All right, it has been a while since we've done anything like this, so let's do this. You guys, yeah, just get, just get into it. Okay, we had the Ultimate Kickoff 2 preview come across today, and to me personally, not the most exciting set of cards. CMC is fine. Von Miller is fine. LTD linemen through rolls, it's, it's always okay, but it's not like super exciting. I was more excited for Fitz, uh, the Chandler Jones, Troy P, all that. I was just more excited for those cards. And the 87s. Which, again, they're all just pretty basic. So, I was like, okay, well, I don't really want all those cards, but here's something you can do. And I, I'm doing it today. Well, there's no limiteds. And I have been was doing it yesterday uh, as well to help sort of, you know, get some stuff done. So, we're on the 83 overall team of the week elite fantasy pack. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why here? Okay, so... As we do rolls for ultimate kickoff, this is a great place to put in cards. You can also put them in 82, uh, all, the all Madden pack and all that. But because Team of the Week came out and these Team of the Week cards were pretty expensive, I was like, oh, this isn't a bad way to sort of take our trash and go into it. So it takes five 78, 79s, five 76 to 77s. It's basically all you pull in the rolls, right? And uh, so if you add up like the total cost after tax, it's like 15 or 16,000. So it is a little more, but you're not selling 10 cards to do it. Okay. And that, that, that's kind of the point here. Yes. Just selling your cards sometimes is indeed the best. So why, why do the 83s matter? Because the, the team of the week sets, <laughs> they, they just say 87 right now, any 87 team of the week, which includes the preseason 87s as well. And you build the preseason 87s with the preseason 83s okay so that's the way that it would go now in 83 right now uh that's a 10 under 10k is a good deal uh we'll just go ahead and buy that guy uh but normally it's around like 12 12 ish k right so uh, around 12k uh we see 12 13 whatever it is right it takes eight of them which is like ninety six thousand coins call it 90 to 96,000 coins is probably what you're going to end up buying uh, your cost there through doing it. And buying these 87s is, again, it's around the same price. It is coming down. I'm not saying this is like good forever, but this is just, again, something to think about when you have a bunch of pack trash. Where like, where do you do with it, right? So it's cheaper to buy these cards, but if you do the rolls, it's kind of helpful. And if you do the rolls... You can also like again you're turning your trash in tomorrow there's ltds and again buy the cheapest training possible as always uh, if we look at ultimate kickoff then we can build or pre-build 87 overalls basically and they don't take a lot it's 285 and uh five or four 82s right this is not terrible it's not terrible so if there's some tomorrow that you want specifically you might want you can do this and then you can use that to make the set and all sorts of stuff so it's like a very arbitragey type method well i've been doing it and as i've been doing it i've been hitting things which is great i've hit a 90 overall troy and fits okay so so that's for me now i've only been doing this 100,000 coins at a time which is 7,000 training basically uh at this point and i still have some stuff in here and i've kept some of these other little elites uh, that I've pulled because like, oh, maybe I want to do something here. Maybe I don't. But uh, I've been selling my stuff more than because like I have time, right? I have the app. I'll take my 16,000 coins post tax, basically over buying a card for 12,000 or 13,000. Again, I'm not in a rush to get the team of the week cards. We know that there's a make right coming and all that. So I'm doing the selling route. If you don't want to do the selling route, that's the other way. But we're going to roll to 7,000. And we're going to see if we can get lucky or not. Again, I'm doing this when there are not LTDs in rolls. So it's probably not the world's smartest thing. But a lot of people aren't doing rolls. So maybe they're a little bit better because of that. Because you guys ain't stealing all my good pulls. If you're looking to build the best team in Madden or any other game, make sure you head over to MMOEXP.com. Avoid the pack, save some racks, pick up your mutt, empty, and many other games. Use code CC 5% off. Let's be great. All right, instead of actually showing you those packs because they were really, really bad, um, we'll just tell you about what, what we got here. 33 packs, one elite actually on the first roll. Crazy, only an 82. 
Um, and if there was five high golds and then 27 low golds, one elite, which is going to make us about 54,000 coins back pre-tax maybe post-tax if you lazy sell a bit better um so you're gonna lose fifty thousand coins that's a pretty worst case scenario one elite in that range again i've had roles where i've pulled no elites i've had roles where i've pulled five or six elites and the reason we do one hundred thousand coins here is it minimizes our risk right if you put up and you have 50,000 training, most people feel that they're gonna just run it down to zero or whatever. This kind of keeps us honest and check. And if you have a bad roll, maybe you wanna stop. If you have a good roll, you also can stop and know when to walk away. So really, really important there. So I'll get rid of all this stuff. And like I said, I will sell it because I have the time to sell it. Hop on the app. I check the app about once an hour is really it. And then I get rid of the stuff and do all that. But again, I'm doing this today. I bought this training at like, it was 20,000 coins for an 85, probably give or take, maybe like 20,300. Occasionally one would pop up for 19. I bought them for 15 for, but for the most part, right? So make sure that you are checking the training prices before you do anything with training roles and make sure you are buying the cheapest training that you can. Again, maybe the market will be affected tomorrow once the ultimate kickoff promo comes out again. If you remember headliners part two definitely got affected things went way up where the, those cards were were pretty good though holland jefferson the, people really wanted those cards i don't feel that there's going to be the same desire for von miller and christian mccaffrey and these 87s and the brandon scherf but maybe there is and if there is then expect everything to go up and follow suit so even for me like i'll sell I'll get rid of my stuff. Don't mind because I'm not really playing to like try to get that stuff. And this is the same process I will be using tomorrow as well, because we're obviously going to roll to try to pull Brandon Scherf in these new cards. And what will I do with my trash? This is exactly what I'll do. I've quick sold stuff before because I was lazy and it's a really, really bad idea. Putting it somewhere and losing a little bit of value is way better than quick selling it and losing nine. Like you lose like 95% of your value on a gold when you quick sell it. It's ridiculous. Okay. Don't quick sell the gold unless you're really just, you're well off coin wise or you're bored. You don't have time. That's up to you. But this is a method that we used. It's not a guaranteed coin making method. Um, it's not even a coin making method. How about that? It's not even a coin making method, but you can't, it is how you turn your training into coins for team of the week cards, potentially, and they have value. And then hopefully again, getting lucky. That's kind of the process that I was thinking and trying to take yesterday. But then I just decided after, after EA put out the little tweet that we're going to get make rights for team of the week, I said, Oh, let me not go try to build these team of the week cards right now. And I'm just going to start selling everything off with the slightly inflated prices. So I was going to do it. And then I said that I was like, ah, I'll just back off. I can be patient, be patient too. It is very, very important. Be great. Take care. I love you guys. I'm out. Peace.